First Bank Southwest, Gooden Fuels, Amarillo College, Capital Farm Credit, and Texas Farm Bureau. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Whiteface Gym. Tom Simon and Brenda will be joining me here in just a minute. We're courtside here tonight for the Whiteface meeting with the Lady Eagles of Canyon. The uh, second round of play getting underway here tonight on the Whiteface Gymnasium. Herford 5 0 after the first round. 37 and 2 now, I believe, on the season. The number one ranked uh, in the state, Lady Whitefaces, taking on Canyon here today. Canyon with two losses in the first round to Herford and to uh, Dumas. So, uh, Lady Eagles can get themselves right back in it here tonight with a win over the Whitefaces on the road as Canyon takes their swings at the net right now. Lady Whiteface roster, including uh, Emma Jones. Uh, Nikola Watley, London Baker, Tatum Stowe, Cameron Blair, Kendall Blair, Miranda Acosta, Micah Blasios, Emma Cooper, Bonnie Vallejo, Nevea Coronado, and Autumn Wilburn. That's Coach Carly McCracken's crew. Coach McCracken's assistants are Christy Jones and Chris Fry. And uh, Clara Sims and Angelina Padilla are the managers for the Lady White Faces. Lady Eagles with uh, Sarah Morath as the head lady. And just call, talking to a couple of the dads of Lady Eagles, uh, one of those is Cody Simmons, uh, his daughter Brooklyn uh, on the Canyon crew here tonight, and uh, she'll be playing against the White Faces here this evening, and also uh, this is Dr. Rick Roden a moment ago, and of course Dr. Roden uh, Ren is the, uh, she's the setter for the Canyon Eagles, she's a senior, and so the White Faces is uh, squaring off against some people they know uh, from club ball, from up the road, from all those things. And the uh, Hall of Fame coach and five-time state champion, Brenda Kitt, has joined us here wearing a visor tonight to uh, disguise herself from uh, people who might who might notice who Coach Kitt is. And with the visor on, nobody has a clue who she is. Nikki <laughs> Smart in it. So you've been off watching... Coach Crouch and the White Face tennis team uh, dominate again. It was a great day, 10-1 and over Brock. And um, they think they'll be playing Peaster. It's going to be either Peaster or Brownwood. And uh, that is scheduled for, I believe it's noon on Friday, back at Snyder High School. Wow. And uh, they take care of business there. And next Tuesday will be a big showdown, probably against Vernon. And they are, I think they're booked in Lubbock for that one. Wow. So. Well, a great win today. I was thinking, this is the, I believe, Team Tennis, now you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is the only sport where, as a player, uh, you go out ready to play, and if the match ends before it gets to you, uh, you just go back to the house. Yeah, it, it's crazy. Yeah. And, and I was, um, I've been watching the guys singles. They play doubles first. Uh -huh. And um, I have been watching the, the guys single. On one ha one side of the, the courts, and uh, switched over to watch some of the girls, and um, was watching Kalinda in particular. And all of a sudden, it's like she just goes and picks the <laughs> picks the balls that are on the keeping score. She puts those back, and it's like okay, game over. Enjoy playing, y'all. Yeah, yeah. but I tell you what, one of the things that creates it to me, it's one of the most pressure-packed situations in anything, is when it does come down to like yeah. the very last match. Um, because 19 matches get played, and so you've got to win 10. The first one to 10 wins. Um, but if it is, you know, if it is split evenly and you've got one more match left, it is just and, ridiculous the pressure. And you could be is that 17th, 18th, 19th player, somebody who hasn't played yes, it, in a yes. few matches, maybe. It right? very well could be. Yeah, wow. it could be somebody who hasn't played at all in the playoffs. Oh, wow. Well, congratulations to White Face Team Tennis. Uh, Another victory here today as they keep on keeping on. 10-1 to over Brock. Again, if I didn't make that clear, you heard Coach Kitten say when you get to 10. But then once it's over, uh, once you get to 10, I mean, that's that. And on we go. So onward and upward to Friday against either Peaster or did you say? Brownwood. Or Brownwood. Peaster or Brownwood. Oh, I'm telling you what, in tennis, we meet. I mean, there's all kinds of people we don't ever don't ever see. <laughs> I mean, we've never played. Yeah. Well, I'd play Peaster in tennis, but I mean, never. Yeah, and I'm not so sure, Brock, you know, there's not a lot of 3A um, team tennis teams, uh -huh. and so some of the 3As that do have them, they have to play up. 
And so, um, Rocky is three. Yeah, yeah. I know that. Uh, so that's kind of the wow. that's the situation there. But yeah, it's um, it's pressure packed. It's it's fun, and and you know they don't do that in the in normal district or any yeah. other time. You play it out. You play all nineteen matches just so your kids can get some sure. experience. Sure, sure. But uh, man, it's. It's either great if you're on the winning side of it, or it's as cruel as it can be. <laughs> really? All right, the two teams warming up here at Canyon, taking their swings at the net right now. We'll take a 60-second break. Brenda and I'll be back courtside in one minute. Is the call transfer on your office phone system strictly by guest? Is the whole button terminal? WT Services sells, installs, and maintains telephone systems of all sizes that are customized to the needs of your business. The right phone system can mean incoming calls are handled efficiently without embarrassing malfunctions. Contact WT Services today to talk about growing your business with a new telephone system. Call 364-7311 and see what a difference hometown service can make. WT Services, your local full-service communications provider. The tradition Charles Bryant started more than a century ago is about more than heating and cooling. It's about earning the trust of our customers across the country by taking care of their indoor comfort needs. We're continually building upon our solid history of proven reliability. So it's easy for you to sell, install, and service our products. Don't just trust anybody. Take comfort in Bob's, your Bryant factory authorized dealer. Bryant. Whatever it takes. All right, back at Whiteface, Jim, Tom, and Brenda. Whiteface is victorious in three in Canyon the first time around. Again, uh, we've had uh, a couple of rusty matches. Then uh, we've had a couple of pretty good matches. Coach of broadcast uh, on Saturday. We enjoyed listening, Coach, uh, while driving down Wise Highway. Well, were y'all driving at that point? We were. Were you? We were. So then he got it on uh, YouTube. and we, In fact, we, uh, she could watch. I was driving. Oh, wow. so I didn't watch. But, uh, she's so technology. She is. She, right. She's really, she's kind of Miss Techno. That's her. Speaking of techno, uh, Julie is uh, listening in New Orleans tonight. So a lot of pressure because she's kind of a volleyball expert uh, <laughs> having, having seen a match or two. But uh, we're glad to have you, Jewel. Hope everything was good. Down in New Orleans, here's the lady white face just warming up. We took our first swing a moment ago, and it was it was Kendall uh, Kendall Blair who went first, and she hit it about oh, out of 18 feet out. It was embarrassed, you know, sophomore. I mean, just humiliated. So I'm sure she won't be mentioning that. So I thought I would. But we're taking our swings. What, what's your concern tonight, Coach? And this week, for that matter. Well. My concern is we've, we've had a little over a week of, of not being challenged. Okay. I'm concerned about that. I'm concerned that, um, you know, things went well for us the first go round, and, and uh, you know, there's a tendency to think things will just sure. go well, period. And I'm kind of concerned, honestly, how we're warming up. <laughs> we're not very good. We're not very up. good warming up right no, now. No, but I will say this, whatever the sport, in a gym or wherever, I've seen some lousy warm-ups that resulted in real good performances and vice versa. Uh, but hopefully the white faces, we're a little, just a little ragged here at the moment. I mean, we're getting it in the net, top of the net, and uh, trying to get, oh, there's one from Watley. That wasn't in the net. There's Blair, and that wasn't in the net either. So we're on. So not to worry about that part of it, but we do need to play. We need to play well here. Again, we're on the road Saturday for uh, the second meeting with Dumas, and we don't need to look ahead to that either. No, we, we don't, and, and I know that will be a, a huge concern, but I, I don't I don't know. I mean, this, this is one of those situations in sports that kind of, kind of set up to be a little bit scary if you're a Lady Whiteface fan. Well, the White Faces are taking their swing. Brenda and I are courtside. There's a good crowd on hand here on the Hereford side, and we'll be back to bring you a little more of this pregame activity when we come back in 60 seconds. You're out of town? Need to use an ATM? Available on the First National Bank of Hereford website is the Money Pass system. 
This tab will help you locate a surcharge free ATM with over 32,000 ATMs available nationwide. As Hereford's only locally owned bank, we have you covered. We have roots where others have branches. First National Bank of Hereford and Freona Banking Center. Member FDIC and Equal Housing Lender. Electricity travels along an intricate network of wires and poles to power our homes and businesses. Most of the time, it's a seamless journey. But occasionally, the path of electricity is disrupted by articles like fallen tree branches, animals, or car accidents. When that happens, Def Smith Electric Cooperative's line workers are ready to restore that connection no matter the weather or the time of day. For over 82 years, Def Smith Electric, your Touchstone Energy Cooperative. All right, back courtside, Tom and Brenda with you here on this Tuesday evening. Uh, good to hear the voice a moment ago of uh, Brad Land there, Miss Old Brad. He's off down there in Argyle in the big city. I mean, living in the fast lane, but uh, good to hear his voice. Well, uh, White Faces and Eagles now serving to one another. And they will do that, and then we'll have the introduction to the national anthem and all that sort of business, and we'll play some volleyball. My face is, uh, as they serve right now, well, <laughs> we're, not, we're not just wearing it out serving either. Huh? <laughs> we shall see how we play when the whistle blows here in just a minute. Looking on my Facebook today, it was 10 years ago today. Now, this tells you how old I am. 10 years ago today, we went uh, with the Hazes, with John and Polly, to uh, Las Cruces to see Meredith play for New Mexico State against uh, Hawaii. Uh, Hawaii had, I don't remember her name, but they had a server who was just. She threw it higher than the building and then jumped and served <laughs> straight down. It seemed. But... Ten years ago, that just does not turn out possible. But it is. Here's the White Faces one up again. Uh, Emma is a junior. Kyla is a junior. London is a freshman. Peyton a senior. Cameron a junior. Kendall a sophomore. Randa a senior. Micah a senior. Emma junior. Bonnie senior. Yavea a senior. And Autumn is a junior. That's the roster. He lost the JV match in two a while ago. Good match. And I went over, I don't know, we were playing well in the freshman. I don't know if we won or not, but uh, we really, really played well. So the two teams have finished serving to one another. We've got uh, Charlene Sanders down there on the uh, scorebook of the PA and all that. And she'll be calling out the team's name. We'll be playing the national anthem, and then uh, we'll get to play here in just a few minutes. That's three out of five, as you know. We're at Whiteface Gym here tonight. The newly remodeled, but yet not finished, Whiteface Gym. <laughs> I was just texting Kate Bach, and she, she was watching online, and she goes, what happened to the bleachers? <laughs> <laughs> Someone broke in and stole them. We don't know. Exactly. Have, you know. But, uh, no, well, we're in December now, right? Is December, that... we are scheduled at this point to be able to get those in there in, uh, over the Christmas break. So, well, knock on wood right now. Yeah, really. that through. In a world where everything is short or is out in the harbor somewhere yeah, waiting to be exactly uploaded. Exactly right. Good to see Roger and Shelly over there, Carly's mom and dad. Roger looking dapper here as he sets, looking on at Whiteface Jim. Whiteface is uh, wearing the maroon here tonight with uh, white numerals. Canyon uh, wearing the purple with the black numerals. We're going to take a break for a minute and a half, Lisa. We'll be back courtside in a minute 30. When you're shopping for your next Chevy, GMC, or Buick, make sure you come and visit Stevens Five Star. Here's what David wrote about his experience. It was very pleasant and hassle-free. Mr. Ramirez was very helpful, and I'll be back. Thanks, David, and we look forward to seeing you again. Visit StevensFiveStar.com or come in and experience exceptional pricing, value, and service firsthand. To get five-star treatment every day, Stevens Five Star Car and Truck Center. Herford ISD, we are committed to children and dedicated to excellence. 
Hereford ISD encompasses over 900 square miles. We educate approximately 4,000 students each year and employ approximately 650 employees. Hereford ISD buses over 700 students to and from school each day. We provide 14 bus routes and drive over 1,100 miles per day. We choose to make a difference in the lives of all of our children. Go Herd! First Financial Bank knows how important a person's vehicle can be. My SUV is perfect for taking clients to properties and me to the golf course. My pickup hauls work supplies all week and the family on weekends. My hybrid helps the environment and my fuel bill. If you're ready for a new vehicle, talk to First Financial. We offer loans at competitive rates with fast local approval. My 4x4 works hard but plays even harder. First Financial Bank. You first. Member FDIC. Back here, White Face Jim, uh, the Eagles being introduced. And uh, as, after that's done, then we'll introduce the Lady White Faces, and then we'll begin to play some volleyball. Lots of youngsters on the Canyon team. Yeah. Uh, it seems like they've got more suited up than they did when we were there. I think we don't have, the, don't have the roster here before us tonight, but I think they had three or four freshmen on the mm-hmm. varsity when we played them over there. It'll... Yep. White Faces is being introduced right now. White faces. Let's hope. Let's see. London Baker did a better job of throwing her volleyball this time. She didn't hit anybody at the scores table. The uh, each of the players. <laughs> for some reason, Deanne gets two. I don't know why that is. She has two daughters on the team, I suppose. Come on, I mean, toss it a long way up there. Wow. Well, there's another one. Bonnie. Bonnie's a softball player. Good luck. And last but not least is uh, Autumn. And we've done all we can do here, I believe, in the pregame as the White Faces and uh, Lady Eagles meet at the net. Butterflies. I'm not kidding you. I've, I've got a little nervous about this one right here. I was counting while uh, they were introducing everybody there. Since 1990 in the playoffs, uh, we uh, that was the first time we've been in the playoffs. And since 1990, there are 26 banners out of uh, 31 possible opportunities up there on the wall. That's pretty darn amazing. We are missing. We're missing lines callers. They're still in the other um, gym. Lines callers are next door still calling the JV. Let's see. I don't know. We're going to wait or we're going to go. That's what Clark says. White faces uh, out on the floor, as are the Lady Eagles. But, again, what what happens, coaches explain this, uh, two officials call the uh, freshman game when we have four officials, and they're calling that next door. I guess they're in the third third set of that one, Coach, must be. Yeah. Ms. Valdez is going to call line. She's an official in the association. And she'll call. And? And? Coach Marquez is happy about calling yeah, that until they get here. She's smiling big. <laughs> Coach Marquez and Miss Valdez. Miss Valdez, we're in. We're ready to go. So as soon as the other officials get here, they'll sub in. Sarah's here next to us as the white face footballers off this week. White faces will have uh, Cameron Blair along with Autumn and uh, Michaela and London. Bonnie and Miranda, the six out there. The Lady Eagles, it is, uh, let's see who they've got. Lady Eagles have uh, Jay, along with their opening server, Colwell, my friend Colwell. Going out there by Snelson. And we're ready to play. Here we go. Everybody's ready. Officials on the floor. And the opening point of this best of five is underway. And it's in the net. What enough he hurt Probably a little nerves, honestly, on both yep, sides right yep, here. Yeah, I think you're exactly right. It's kind of a nervous, nervous serve right there. Here we go. But Miranda, no nerves for Miranda. Good serve. Good pass for Canyon. Near side. Big swing. Great play by London to get it up. Saved by Miranda and over. Great save by the white face. Canyon, near side. Big swing. And they find the middle of the floor. It's one all as the kill belongs to uh, Hogan. Hogan was their 
leader in kills when we played them over at Kenton. Two slide plays by by uh, the Lady Eagles and a uh, second one down for the score. Maddie, to show up. Maddie Lewis serves. Oh, we have trouble with it, and we just free ball it over. Canyon set far side, big swing. We tip it, dug up by Miranda, set near side now. Cameron, Cameron, big swing along, and it's two to one Canyon. So the white face is not sure we ever trailed over Canyon. <laughs> Three sets. I'm not. Uh, my memory's not 100, percent but I think that's right. Here the white face is set, and on the far side, nice set to Blair. Blair with a kill. We're tied at two. Nice pass out of service received that time. Gave the chance for a little one in the back. Emma now to serve for the White Faces. So in Bonnie and Wilburn up on the net with her. Good service by Emma. Far side up, tipped over, saved by London. Bumped up near side. Bonnie rolled it. Canyon gets to it. Can't play it. Great play by Bonnie. Great play. I mean, she knew she couldn't get the big swing on it. She rolled it just probably six feet deep, and they couldn't play it. Three, two. Here we go. Emma serves. Good service again. This one will be an eight. It's four to two, Arthur. Nice serve by Emma, Emma Jones. Why did they call a replay on that? Interference? Well, I guess the ref is in the way. I mean, the line judge, I guess, is in the way. Three, two. No point. Emma serves near side. Canyon this time tips, and they're not there. Nice tip by Roden, and it's three all. Well, we don't seldom see that. I'm not sure it had anything to do with the play, but uh, Canyon player collided with the line judge. Here come the officials from the other gym. They'll step in here in a minute. We're tied at three as Roden serves. Good service. London, good set. It's blocked. The white baseman. Back over to the far side, Wilbur, cross court. Canyon digs it up, 3-3 three, three in the opening set here at the white face gym. Canyon tipped up by the white faces, played up by Miranda, pushed near side up high, Bonnie, it's out. 4-3, Canyon with a one point lead here in the opening set as the white faces, uh, well, one official stepped in, now the other comes in. So now we've got four official officials. We're down 4-3, to three. Canyon serves. Good service, good pass by Wilbur. Back to Wilburn. Wilburn, big swing. Canyon on the back line. Bumps it up and rolls it across. Blocked by Stowe. We're tied at four. Great play by Stowe. Yeah, we have got to see blocks like that. We we have not started this match out with good blocks except until right now. Four all opening set. Micah Palacios to serve for the White Faces. And this is the start of round two of the district. White Faces 5-0 in the opening round. Good serve by Micah. Canyon is going to have to free four. ball it over. Four. Chance to score. Emma to Micah. So we stole on the slide. It is five four Herbert. So now with a kill and a block, and White Faces have a one point lead. Again, Micah serves deep corner. It's an ace. Wow. Great serve. Bottom dropped out of that one. Six four Herbert. Just a little jump serve. It just kind of knuckles across there and it really dies. That's what you want. Good serve again, but this was too deep. Well, they play it. The back line, Canyon plays it. They just free ball it over. We got a chance right here. Miranda, Micah, near side, Bonnie. Bonnie, cross, short of the end. I think she's kind of got them guessing right now. Seven to four here in the opening set. Herford scored four in a row. Canyon Stowe went around for the quick slide and uh, really spread out the blocker. Served into the net. Seven to five. Herford by two. Two-point lead, opening set, white face gym, Herford and Canyon. The server for Canyon is Hawkins. Hawkins jump serve off the top of that ball. Goes Canyon's side, another service error by the Eagles. 8-5, Herford. Tatum back to serve. Watley by Ho and uh, Kendall Blair up on the net. Good service by Watley. I mean, by it. So, Canyon near side. We block it, but he falls on Herford's side. The kill belongs to uh, Taylor Thomas of Canyon. Canyon now with uh, Simmons coming in up on the net. 8-6 Herford in the opening set. It is Cry serving for Canyon. Jumps and serves. Emma, good pass. Like a good set. And there's the kill by Watley. The white face lead it. 9-6. Need a little bit more of that. Uh, Mike and uh, uh, Michaela doing it that way. She can get up there. Here's Bonnie to serve. 9-6 Herford. Bonnie near side. Canyon. 
Got a great pass. And out the door, it's Kim Kirkman. Cameron didn't get a great initial pass, but they got it over to, uh, I think it's Winfrey. Yep. He's one of the freshmen. It's Tim Sixerpin. Honey serves. He looks tight on the net this time. Bump it across. Serpent plays four. it up. Near side, there is Blair. They dig Blair on the back line. Nice dig near the net. Big tip played up by the white faces. Back to the near side. Cameron off the net. He gets the top, top of the court. Canyon plays it back. Far side. Big swing. Herpin digs it up. Nice dig by Bonnie. Back in the middle. Herpin calls for a lift. 10 7. White faces by three in the opening set. Canyon serving. It is Jay at the service line. 10 7 Herpin. Jay serves. Bonnie. Micah. Bonnie behind the 10 foot line. Bonnie with her third kill. Uh, you, you've talked about that. She likes that back row set. She does like the back row. She hit a lot out of the, on the, on the front row out of the middle on, sat, on the Saturday. So, using her in different areas. Yeah, she's a good player. London serves for the first time. The freshman serves deep. Canyon plays it. Far side. Seven. Dug up by Miranda. London sets Watley. Watley up high. They can't play it. Nice job by Baker and Watley. My Baker lead at 12-7. Again, London serving. Wilburn and Blair and Watley up on the net. Jump, serve, Canyon. Over to Simmons. Big jump. We tip it, but she can't throw it. Going for the Lady Eagles, 12 8. Four point advantage for Herford. Canyon serving. It is uh, Colwell to serve here in set number one. Colwell. Off the top of the net, Miranda plays it nicely. Back here jumps to Blair. Big swing, Blair. He hits him and they play it over. Back over to Autumn. Autumn, nice swing. Dug up by Canyon on the back line. Played back to the middle. Perfect with a block. Saved by Blair. Played to Watley. Watley pushes it deep. Can't, smart. can't play. What a play by Watley. Smart, smart play. 13 8 here, but she didn't have a great set. She just pushed it over the block. Back in the right uh, corner. Served by Miranda. Oh, no, it comes across. Herbert sets Stowe and Stowe. They dig Stowe up. Canyon dumps it. And Stowe blocks it. The top that time came right back at him. It's a uh, point for the light faces. It's 14 8 Herbert. Time out. Canyon, we're back in 30 seconds. Needing extra income? Looking for a full-time job with advancement opportunities? McDonald's in Hereford is hiring full-time and part-time people who are energetic and customer-focused. At McDonald's, you will be able to work flexible hours, whether it's three hours or eight hours per day. Benefits include a free meal when you're working and a 30% discount when you're off-duty. Earn a vacation benefit and $10 an hour and above with experience. To apply, just text TX162 to 38000. All right, back white base gym, 14-8 Herford in the opening set. Well, I mean, we haven't played brilliantly, but we haven't played poorly either, Coach. No, no, we just, if there's one area that's just fighting us in the backside, it's our blocking. Uh, we've had a few hitting errors, too, but um, we, we just have got to get consistent. Every free ball we get ought to end up being three options on offense. All right, here we go. Miranda to serve. Senior serves to the middle. Canyon passes to the net. Big block by the white faces. There back go. over and out. There's the block. Uh, Stowe. Stowe at Wilburn, actually. And the white faces lead it. Now 15 8. Miranda serves. Cross court. Canyon, not a good pass this time. Lady Eagles off the net. Herbert blocks back to the net. Stowe up. Down it goes. Stowe gets her third kill. The white faces lead it 16 8. And just get them back on their heels and don't let up. Miranda ready from the near corner. She serves to the middle. Canyon, better tie. In the middle. Blocked by the white faces. Canyon's going to get it across. Here's London now going to run. Oops, we didn't run anything. 16-9. I don't know what we were going to run the slide play. I assume but he didn't get it there. 16-9, Irvin. Maddie Lewis now serves for the Lady Eagles here in the opening set. Good service, good pass by Bonnie. Set Stowe, Stowe is straight down. Stowe with four kills, I'm telling you, tough time. London. <laughs> Love that 31 set. 
<laughs> you give it at the height of her jump and reach, it is, there's nobody going to no. win. Emma serves 17 9. Again, a great serve by Emma. And Daniel can't play it. It's another ace. That's two aces for Emma. Well, her serve has been blistering here tonight. 18 9 Irvin. Time out, Canyon. We're back in 30 seconds. In an emergency, critical health care issues can't wait. Neither can minor illnesses, regular health care appointments, nor checkups. The team at Hereford Regional Medical Center wants you to know that regular health care needs can be addressed in our facility, where we've taken steps and precautions to keep you safe against COVID-19. Call our clinic at 806-364-7512 or visit our website at dschd.org. All right, back here court side, 18-9, Herford in the opening set. Can with a timeout, best of five here at White Face Gym tonight. Big crowd as the Eagles come to town. I mean, we've got behind us, of course, the Pena family. Danielle and Josiah, they can come here to the video, but they can't go to San Angelo, you know. That's kind of the way they <laughs> I wouldn't let them video in Herford. I mean, they can either. <laughs> that's right. Danielle says so what? Uh, <laughs> All right, Emma serves at 18-9. They both have jobs. I might add Emma into the net. That's our second service error of the match, 18-10, to 10, Irvin. And it's Roden back to serve. Her brother, uh, a little 74 over at, uh, talking to Rick earlier, 74 over at Palajura this weekend. Uh-oh, Herford can't handle that serve, and it's 18-11. Service ace for the Eagles, Roden. Run back to serve again. 18-11 white faces. Go to serve. Good pass by Jones. Near okay. side of high body. And body with her fourth kill of the match. Then she just sails through the air. I mean, so smooth. Everything about her is smooth. 19-11 her. Here's Micah back to serve as the white face is up by eight here in the opening set. Good service. Canyon. Can they get it over? They do, but they oh, oh. play it. <laughs> no, we didn't. We were just scrambling. We played one that was probably out. Back it goes. Now, can you get a chance to score here? Far side. Through the block. Great dig by the white faces. Jones, and we get it across. Great save. Canyon near side. Blocked by the white faces. Fist it up. Tipped over. White faces keep it alive. Back it goes to Canyon. What a rally here. Dumped over. Played up by the white faces. Set, and the white faces got across the net. Micah rushing for that. 19-12. Good play on both sides of the net there, but Canyon winds up with the point. we got to get the pass high enough yeah. so the setter can get to it. The, the quicker the ball went back and forth, we just never regained good control. Hoggins to Jones to Stowe. Stowe just puts, <laughs> puts it where they ain't. That's five for Tatum, and it's 20 to 12, Herbert. And Tatum back to serve. Stowe loves to serve, loves to play from the back row. Oh, there's an ace right there. That's why she learned. Yeah, absolutely. 21-12, Herford. We love for her to serve like that. Say, that's a pretty good way to do it. 21-12, Herford. Made him ready again. Near side this time. Can you a better pass? Far side. Big swing. And they hit it out. It's 22-12. Like faces up by 10. Three points away from the opening set. Still ready again. Far side. Canyon. Tip, played over by, nope, white faces don't get it over, but they get it back, Bonnie, they block Bonnie, Herford plays it back over, great save again by the white faces, far side, Canyon, bad pass, 22 to 12, 23-12, it's a great play a moment ago by Emma Jones, it kind of went unnoticed there, but uh, she was behind the line, behind the hitters, and picked up a ball that she shouldn't have. Saved our bacon. She did, 23-12, another good serve, Canyon across, yep, came across. Went to the white face, it's 24-12. Whoops. All right, we're going to play it again. Because, I don't know why, 23-12. Perfect by 11. Short serve this time. Canyon, big swing and a kill. 23-13. Well, we've lost one point. We ran into an official. And then, I don't know. Why did we play that over, do you know? I guess he thinks that her foot was not all the way across the line. And she maintained contact with the line. I see. My guess. I thought she hit it into the antenna anyway. Out of the middle, there's Bonnie. Canyon, near side. 
perfect great dig by Micah, played up near side body, big swing, Canyon in the net, 24-12, 24-13, White faces need one more. Serve it up by 11 in the opening set, it's Bonnie to serve for the opener for the White Faces. Good service. Oh, what a play by, golly, Miranda. Canyon overpasses, and there's Watley, but they play it back up. Canyon far side. Oh, Big swing down the line. It's out. Going to the White Faces. 25-13. The White Faces win the opener. We're back with set two in a minute. 30. For generations, First Bank Southwest has been there to help the working hands that have shaped this great land. Chances are we helped your father, his father, and even his father. We understand for some, a handshake is a stronger bond than a piece of paper. And even though times can be tough, folks around here are tougher. And that's why we're as proud of our panhandle roots as you are. First Bank Southwest, moving your generation in the right direction. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. Your business, farm and ranch, or home is unique, and success depends in part on a cost-effective and convenient supply of quality fuel. When you trust your fueling needs to Gooden Fuels, it's one less detail for you to manage. Commercial fuel in bulk in below-ground or above-ground tanks, serving the western panhandle with gasoline, diesel, and propane. Gooden Fuels in Hereford, 364-3366. Start here. Hey, see. Go in here. College is the place to prepare. After serving my country in the military and about with colon cancer, I got a new start right here at Emerald College. Great programs, great faculty, start here, go anywhere. Trust your future to a college that cares. Start here, go anywhere. All righty, back to White Face Gym, 2513. The White Faces win the opener as we're between sets here. White face crowd really uh, pretty quiet for the most part. I mean, uh, they're, you know, not quite the intensity there was, let's say, for the Dumas match when it was here. No. First one went 29-27. I, I hope Sammy Lionel's up there. She made some she did. popcorn, and I'm telling you, that is just what I needed after <laughs> a day in Snyder. <laughs> A day in the what? I've got such a headache, and I think it's from the wind. Uh, oh, the wind. Yeah, I'm sure wind. it was down there. It was brutal wind. here today. It was. You try to toss to serve. And, I bet. I, I, mean, I really told Cindy, what? So many yeah, of those. You know, playing golf and tennis in the wind is just brutal. But it's what you do if you live where we live. You might as well grow accustomed to it. The white face is up. A set. Ready to go here in set number two. Old buddy Bob Baker up there at the top, Cindy and him are sitting together. They both pretty knowledgeable about volleyball. Bobby and Briar up there too, probably explaining them what's going on. <laughs> Travis, Travis sitting over across the way. Someone asked me about Travis. Travis is the same age you was as when I moved here, 50 years. Ago. That's how old Travis is. It's amazing. It really is. Looks just the same. There's Miranda. He is a fan, isn't he? He is. Ran Umstead over there helping out with the cheerleaders these days and heard a little bit what a cutie. Yeah, and her mama. And her mama too, too. yeah. The whole whole bunch. Here we go. Miranda to serve. Miranda serves to start game number two. This another Miranda. Great play by Baker to get it up. All the white faces fail to play it back. We have had two or three issues where we just didn't play. One nothing can. Canyon serving here in the second set, down a set for the Lady Eagles. It's Lewis to serve. Bonnie overpasses. It tips right back down. Two to nothing, Canyon. So two white face mistakes uh, lead to two equal points as they go up here in the second set. Lewis serves again into the net. Two to one. White face is down by one. In comes Emma. Out comes Cameron. Wilburn, Vajo, and Stowe up on the net. Served by Emma. The back line, Lady Eagles, far side, tip it over. Bonnie digs it up. Play it to Stowe. Stowe swings and puts it down. Her sixth kill. Two to two. Right face is tied up now. Emma hustles back. Emma, a junior. Miranda, senior. Baker, a freshman. Three on the, or two on the net are seniors. 
Gilbert to Jr. Back to the middle, thrown over by Canyon, played up by the White Faces. They just free ball that one over, Miranda Will. And it's played back far side. Peggy Eagles out. And a tip ball in the White Faces. That's for the White Faces. 3 2 Canyon. So we're not uh, real sharp starting the second set here, up a set. Roden back to serve for Canyon now. Good service. Pass Wilburn. They block and play it back up and free ball it over. No, roll it over. Four. Miranda. Stowe. And they take Stowe. Play by Ken. Far side. Eagles. Free ball it over again. We need to score right here. In the middle and the white faces. Down to two. What was the call, Coach? I think across the line. We've got a flat pass that. Yeah. Let her let her set her into the net. Standing up four to two. So just tip it Four three. So with her seventh kill. Golly, I love to see when when hitters go up and you know, and just use their peripheral to find the open spot. Yep. Counts the same whether you warp the boards or not. Four three canyon, Micah serves. End of the net, four all. I think Canyon is Service received is so much better it today is. than the first time we played them. I would agree. Four all now. Michael ready again. Deep. Two deep. That's our third service error. And it's by four Canyon. And he's got five points. And four of them have been quite face to face. Here is Canyon to serve. Good service. Micah. Stowe. And they can't play it. Stowe gets the kill. Five all now. Go back to serve. Watley up on the net along with Vejo and uh, Blair. We really just haven't got any kind of rhythm here thus far. Good serve by Stowe. Can't you know? Uh, uh, there was a lift. What called? Micah set Stowe behind the 10-foot line, and Canyon picks it up on the back line. Lady Eagles, big swing. Great. Big by Emma. Right over here to Bonnie. Bonnie through the double team. Canyon digs it up. Far side Eagles cross court and White Faces can't play it. Six five. Canyon's uh, Peter Thomas with the kill. The Lady Eagles lead it six five. I would have to say Canyon's defense is a lot better it than is. it was first go round two. It really is. Smells to serve now for the Lady Eagles. They have a six five advantage here in the second set. Miranda off the net now and. Uh, Vallejo, and there's a tip, six all. Vallejo with a kill for fifth. Canyon tried to play it, but kicked kick it, the ref said. Canyon coach protests, but in vain, and the call is six all. There's really not any discussion of this. The call was made by the official, and it's a six all match with Bonnie Service. Canyon, cross court now, and it's seven to six, Herbert. Let's go now. Bonnie hustles back. Watley and Cameron and Kendall up on the net. Bonnie serves. Canyon, there we go. Bad set. Here we go. Near side now. Blair, Blair puts it down. Good job by Cameron. So Cameron just blasted the heck out of it. First time we played him, too, when he needs to get hot he like did. that. He's got two here served by body. Canyon. Simmons. And Simmons with a kill. 8-7. White bases by one. Well, we make a little run, and then we just kind of, I mean, Canyon, to their credit, Canyon was certainly, uh, as coach said, played much better than they did over in Canyon. Jay to serve now. Bonnie. Micah. Watley. They block Watley. Jay. White base is playing back up. And eight off. At the net, there was a little confusion. Watley hit it, I suppose, twice in a row was the call. In the event, we're tied at eight. Micah sets Blair. And Blair threw the block, and he comes right back accidentally. Blair threw the block, and they didn't swing this one back. <laughs> Folks, it's 9 8 Herford. Get a deep cross angle the first time. And they sit it back the next time. She just hit it a sharper angle. That was a hard yep. shot to hit. 
the first time uh, they sent it back because it hit their face and came back. <laughs> Nine eight London serve. Good service by Baker. Pass by Ken. Near side. Tipped over and out. And it's 10 8 over. Eagles tried to tip that time. Now London hustles back. Baker at the line. 10 8. White faces were in the second set. Herbert up a set. London serves near corner. Canyon. Far side. Simmons cross court. Cameron. Back to Cameron, up high. They get a block on it, play it up. Canyon does, far side. Simmons through the block, and it's 10 9. Rookie Simmons with her third kill of the match, and White Faces lead it by one. Colwell now to serve for Canyon. 10 9 White Faces in the second set. Lady Eagles, right with, oh, great serve there. The White Faces overplay it. They had uh, a lift called on the White Faces, 10 all. Oh, well, ready again. 10 10 on the second set. It would behoove us to kind of wake up here at something. That's out. 10 11, Herford, or 11 10, Herford by one. Fourth service here on Canyon. Herford has three. Miranda serves. White face is up by a point here in the second set. Miranda serves. Canyon can't get hit today. And that's the first ace by Miranda, but the fifth ace by the white face. 12 10, Herford. Miranda again gets service. Far side. Down the line and out. Going to the white faces. 13 to 10. The white faces now. On a little bit of a run as Miranda hustles back. Serves far corner. Again, better pass this time. Here's Bonnie to London. And oh. Joe puts it straight on the floor. Her ninth kill. It's 14 to 10. Urban. Same set right there. That 31. And she just, she was. Totally on top of that. She was indeed. Good service again and again. Not a good pass by Canyon. Blocked by the white faces. Canyon in the middle. Tips it. Herford blocks it again. And Herford's in the net. 14-11. Herford by three. Honestly, probably made more mistakes in this set than we've made in the last three matches combined. Canyon serves at 14-11, Herford. Miranda, not a good pass. It's an ace, 14-12. Good serve by Lewis. It's a two-point set here with the White Faces up a set against the Lady Eagles. Ooh, we're going to let that one hit. Here's Stowe, and they'll not be playing that one if Stowe gets her tenth kill. 15-12, Herford. Now Emma in to serve. Good, thank you. White faces with a three-point advantage. Thanks to Brian Hedrick, trying to make sure we stay well watered here. Emma down on the near side. Good pass by Canyon, far side. Herford blocks it, Stowe. Makes it 16 to 12. Stowe's fourth block of the match. 16-12, Herford, Emma Jones serving in the second set. Emma to the middle, Canyon. Near side, runs the slide place, dug up by Baker. Back near side, two by Ho, dug up by Canyon. Far side, Lady Eagles, cross. Bonnie. Stowe, they get the Stowe, no, nope, get big enough. Stowe's got 11, the White Faces lead it 17 to 12. Emma serves again now. Timeout Canyon in the second set, Herbert by five, back 30 seconds. Well, there's nothing like the sound of a new baby calf or the smell of fresh rain on a cotton crop. My friends at Capital Farm Credit share this excitement with agricultural and livestock producers. We want to be your lending partner. Whether you require operating funds for next year's crop or need to buy hay for your cattle, we have a loan that's right for you. Let us finance your operation. CapitalFarmCredit.com Back here at courtside, 17 to 12, Murford. We need a little more separation than this. <laughs> we just serve. Yeah. We're a little bit careless about some moments and some points. And, you know, I don't. we don't need to just beat ourselves up. But, no. But we do need to be, if, if we're going to grow, we've got to be very mindful about uh, every, every single point, every single touch on every point. Herford by five after the Canyon timeout. Emma to serve. She does. Canyon doesn't make a great pass. Five. They tip it over. Emma digs it up. London sets it. 
up high goes Bonnie. They get to it, tip it over. White faces dive for it, save it, and free ball it over. Gandon with a chance to score here now. Let's see what the Eagles do. They run the slide play. Herford blocks it, but the ball goes over his side. 17-13, Canyon points. White faces by four. Canyon serving. Wrote the serve here. Lady Eagles, three and two in the district. Herford is five and oh. Oh. Third ball, 17-14. Careless. Mike Faith is just, again, another unforced error. And Roden serves again. Good pass to London. Oops. A little over set there, and Canyon able to play it. Far side, Canyon bumps it across. London, near side to Bonnie. Bonnie, big swing, and Canyon... Gets it across. Great save by Canyon. Stowe tries to put it down. Canyon plays it back. London sets Stowe again. They block it. Played up by Wilbur. Set again. Near side now to Bonnie. Bonnie off the top of net fourth. Canyon plays it. Pushes it back to the middle. Gets it over. Herbert plays it up. Back near side. Off the net now. Bonnie down the line and in. Oh, out. Oh, no. 70-15. Point for Canyon. It's a two-point set. Wow. Big miss. <laughs> White faces by two, wrote and serves. We're in the second set. Emma, good pass. London. Stowe puts it on the floor. Her is 12 kill. It's 18 15 Herford. You know, Canyon is just dug in yep. deep for the deep ball. And I think if we would give a few little more off speeds or some shifts, I think our, our it would bring them out of that. Good serve by Micah. The Canyon plays it up. Canyon free falls it over. It is blocked by Stowe. And it's 1950. Herford again by five. Five blocks for Stowe. Or Herford by four. I think towards 1950. Michael, the short serve. Canyon dives and gets to it. For the Winfrey, blocked by Stowe and this young Kimball Blair. Right faces by five. Michael ready again. 20 to 15, Herford. Herford up a step, leading by five here. Michael, good service. Canyon. Big swing. Herford tips it. Little change there by Canyon, and we got up too quick. Went Canyon 20 to 16. When they look like they're going to swing and they go off speed, we have not blocked those. Nope. Uh-uh. I'll get to serve now for the Lady Eagles. 2016 Herford. Good service. Emma digs it up. Herford just has to free ball it over. Canyon's got a chance to score here. In the middle, they tip it. Blocked by Stowe, 21 16. It's not a good idea that the lady needs it. 16 over by five. We're back in 30 seconds. Herd athletes work tirelessly on the fundamentals of their particular sport while learning to work in a team concept. It's not much different at Hereford, Texas Federal Credit Union. Our employees have a dedication to serve our members daily with the fundamentals of good business, being friendly and helping give you peace of mind in knowing that when you need banking assistance, you can get it from our knowledgeable staff. Hereford, Texas Federal Credit Union member NCUA working as a team since 1936 with our members. All right, we're back court by 21-16. My base is lead here in this, the uh, second set. And uh, we have had our struggles here, but uh, we still have a five-point advantage in set number two. We do. And we've got a lot to say this time out, too. We're yeah. <laughs> he didn't call the time out. They were back on court while we still, um, still visiting. Still exactly. chatting. Still chatting, yes. It's we need to score here. Still to serve. He's got a big match. Uh, seven blocks. 12 kills. Wow. Tatum serves at 21-16. Good service off the top of the net. It's amazing. Ooh. Way to plan that. <laughs> Just perfect. Yep. Her second ace. 22-16. She almost smiled. Tatum did, but didn't. Deep. Yeah. And plays it at the back line, and they just free ball it over. And here's Emma to Micah to Watley to the floor. Watley's fourth kill. And the white face is rated 23-16. Love to see that. Yep. Back to uh, Stowe, 23 16. Herford, Herford won by 13 in the first at 13. Just Cannon, not a good pass again. Far side, cross court, body with a dig. Set it back to Bonnie. Big swing down the line and. Whoa. 23 to 17. 
Just long. Just long. All right, well, I base it by six. Canyon serves. It's Nelson to serve. Miranda, Micah, Nikaila, and that's the white face of the 24th point to the fifth kill for Watford. When she gets up high and gets a reach and snaps yep. her core through it, my goodness. Bonnie to serve for the second set. Now, 24 17, her, her service is good. Canyon's fast and decent. Off the net. side. Bonnie with the dig. Oh, here it comes to Blair. She tips it, but Canyon digs it up. Canyon. Cross played up by Bonnie. Set for backside. Nice swing. That's Kendall Blair with the kill. Just puts the exclamation point on it. And the white faces win it 25 17. And go up. Mendez and Mullins Family Funeral Home is proud to announce that we are now Hereford's only family owned and locally owned funeral home serving Deaf Smith County. We would be more than privileged to honor or transfer any prepaid funeral plan to our family-owned funeral home where your loved one is taken care of by local people within our community who show nothing but compassion. So remember, Mendez and Mullins Family Funeral Home, Hereford's only family and locally owned funeral home. Our family serving your family. When life's unexpected moments happen, you can rest easy knowing Prairie Insurance is on your side. Prairie Insurance will listen to you and help tailor a policy to meet your needs. They offer multiple insurance products, including home, auto, business, and farm insurance, with the knowledge to make sure you're covered. Give them a call at 363-6489 or stop by their office at 213 West Park Avenue. When you're ready to have peace of mind regarding the things that matter most, call Prairie Insurance at 363-6489 or stop by 213 West Park Avenue. Avenue and they'll make sure you're covered. Happy State Bank wants to provide you with a little fun, a little friendship, and a lot of professional banking service. Stop by any of our 34 locations, grab a bottle of happy water, and let us help you with your banking needs. Hello, I'm Christina Lucio. We are committed to our communities and we are dedicated to our customers. We're not your normal bank, and we're not your average bank. We are Happy State Bank. Member FDIC. Se habla español. You've been listening to Lady Whiteface Volleyball on KPAN, brought to you. For generations, First Bank Southwest has been there to help the working hands that have shaped this great land. Chances are we helped your father, his father, and even his father. We understand for some, a handshake is a stronger bond than a piece of paper. And even though times can be tough, folks around here are tougher. And that's why we're as proud of our panhandle roots as you are. First Bank Southwest, moving your generation in the right direction. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. All right, back at Whiteface, Jim Herford up to love here with scores of 13 and 17. Canyon to serve first in the third set. It's Colwell to serve and... The white faces receive it. Oh, it's a great serve. It's a hey, Bobby Doe has got a fifth save at Colwell with an excellent serve in the third ace of the match for Canyon. They lead one to nothing. She's the one who missed her serve the first right. first set. And she uh, did anything but. Great serve it was. This one's off the top of the net, and we plant in the middle. Oh. Watley can't quite get to it. She gets it across. Back it comes. Now a chance to score here in London. That. Wilbur and Wilbur cross court great, great swing by Autumn. And the white face is tied at one. Nobody home. Deep right yeah. side for Canyon. Good place to put it. Here we go now. Miranda serving at 1 1 in the third set. Herford up to love. Canyon, near side. Off the top of it. We can't play it again. Griffin Simmons with a kill, and it's 2 to 1. Canyon leads it. As the white face is ready to receive serve from Maddie Lewis. Herford winning by scores of 13 and 17, but again, town and not hitting on all cylinders tonight. Not a great pass there, but over, left-handed tip by the white faces, and that's a ball. What a play. What a play by Cameron Blair. Her fourth kill. I'm telling you, I think Tip will start straight yep. in right now. Well, that one certainly did. did. She, she did it with a left hand to boot. Here's Emma Jones to serve at two. Good service by Emma. Canyon scrambling to get to it and get it across. Miranda to London. The slide play to Stowe. Nice dig by Canyon. Pushed over and tipped by the white faces. Point for Canyon. 
That time, uh, Rosen, the setter up on the net, she just pushed it. We went up, tried to block it. Bonnie got a piece of it, but not enough of it. And it's 3 2 Canyon. Rosen serves here in set three. To Emma, to London, to Snow. Oh, my goodness. Snow right in the face of Colwell. Her 13th kill. That is just violent. Uh, three all. There's nothing Colwell can do except just live to play another point. Mm. Micah serves. Jump serves a beauty. Canyon, though, nice dig. Near side, off the top of the net. The white faces oh. down from four to three. Kid, Canyon. Playing with the white faces. Hogging the serve now. Four, three. Canyon leads by one in the third set. Big jump serve. Emma, not a good pass. To the net, we just free ball it over. Canyon now with a chance to score here. Quick set, tipped up. Nice save by Emma. Herford misplaced it. 5-3, and again, I'm telling you, we have made so many unforced errors here tonight that Coach will have plenty to work on uh, before the match on Saturday at Dumas. 5-3, Canyon. Good service, good pass this time. Stowe. Stowe hits it right on the back line. 14 for Stowe. White bases trail 4-5. Pay them to serve. Stowe's had a couple of aces here tonight. Let's see if she can get a little run to the service line. Good serve, Canyon. Tight on the net. Canyon, tip for the white faces. Six four. White faces trail here in the third set. We're not smiling very brightly out there at the moment. I mean, we're just kind of in a little bit of a, a little bit of a fog. The white faces are here. Snell from the serve, jumps and serves. Emma. Randa, Watley, they get to Watley, they get it back up, and Canyon can't get it across. Watley makes it 6 5. Bonnie to serve, back in comes Blair, Cameron, Kendall, her younger sister, and Watley, the three on the net. Good service by Bonnie, but a good dig in the middle, bumped over, played up by Micah, pushes back far side, up high. White face is. Uh, Kendall, player, but uh, Canyon's in the net. It's six all. Six six. Bonnie serving third set. Her up two sets to love. Bonnie serves far corner. Canyon can't play this one. It's an ace, and it is seven to six. Bonnie's first ace. The White Faces seventh as a team. Seven to six in the third set. Near side this time. Canyon a good pass off the net. Canyon up eight six. Herpin. Bonnie again. White faces with a two-point advantage, trying to sweep Canyon here tonight. Up eight six in the third set. Bonnie serves Canyon. Oh, near side, big swing. We tip it. I can't play it again. Eight seven. White faces by one. In for Canyon comes Jay. On Saturday we're on the road at Dumas. Bonnie, Micah, Cameron. And they can't play it. Cameron with a kill. Her fifth. I think Cameron's going to have a great success getting down the line from that outside spot. I've got one one digger out there. 9 7, Herford by two. London in to serve now. The freshman jumps and serves. And yeah. at the net, there's a battle for it, and it falls on Herford's side. 9 8. That time, Rosen and Cameron went up, and the ball kind of rolled off of. Cameron still on Herford's side. 9-8, Herford. Colwell out the door. So the White Faces lead it 10-8. And Miranda back to serve. The senior from the near side. Floats it to the far corner. Canyon back to the near side. Blocked by the White Faces. That's Stowe and uh, Blair. With the block. Stowe now has eight blocks in the match. 11-8, Herford. Miranda. Canyon, far side, Canyon with a lift, 12 8 Play faces by four, Miranda ready to go again. Play faces uh, down the line, now good, serve Canyon. Big swing and a double kill by Brooklyn Simmons. She came off this outside, went cross court, but it's 12 9. Play faces by three. 
Maddie Lewis back in to serve for the Lady Eagles. White faces with a three-point lead in the third set. Baker sets Stowe, and Stowe gets her 15. She's at quite a nice 15, 8, blocks, and 2, you know, a 2, 8. 13, 9, Irvin Emma Jones in to serve. Go. Try to get rid of a band-aid, and now Carly's out to take care of it. All right, 13, 9, Irvin Emma ready. Third set. Near corner, Canyon, not a great pass. Far behind the net. Canyon bumps it over. I don't know what that one is. Back over to Wilburn. Wilburn cross court. Canyon plays it. They'll get it back and free ball it over. Chance to score. Now Miranda to London. Bonnie. And they take Bonnie on the back line. Canyon. Far side into the net. 15-9. My base is up by five. Emma ready again. Well, the good thing about this is We've got plenty to work on after tonight. <laughs> Emma Serving. Good. Service Canyon will free ball it over. Chance to score here. Go. Tatum, Go. London. London near side to Bonnie. Bonnie down the line. Six for Bonnie, 15 niner. One Canyon defender down that yep. line. Wasn't anything she could do about it. Bonnie put it right down this near, near line in the back corner. Emma with a good serve. Canyon. Big swing. We got a fist up, but we can't play it. Killed by Canyon's uh, Hoggett. 15 10. White base is by five. Roden back to serve. Be interesting to see if Canyon takes what they take out of this. They lost to Dumas in four the first time. Roden a good serve, but Emma a good pass. Off the net now, Bonnie. Big swing cross court and just wide. 15 11. Canyon did play it, not because they thought it was out, but because they couldn't play it. Coming too fast. 15-11, Herford Roden serves. Back to Emma, to London, to Stowe. Stowe can't get much on this one, so Canyon will bump it back over. Stowe plays it up to London, and Herford, 15-12. Herford with a left. Yep. We just uh, have made a lot of mistakes tonight. 15-12, Herford Roden. Nice, nice dig by Emma. Back over to Wilburn. Wilburn cross court. Canyon with a dig and the bump. And the swing. They don't get over. 16-12. Herbert by four. Uh, Kendall Blair comes in. Micah Palacios comes in. Michael will serve. Herbert by four in the third set. Micah. Deep middle of the jump serve. Kendall just foul. Far side. Messi off the net. Nice dig by Miranda. That Stowe, so cross court for a few while. Seven feet to so in midair now. She's on the right side. She cuts it. Turns and cuts it back to the left line. Wow. 17 12. That's impossible to play. Canyon now just, well, they get it across over. 17 13. White faces by four. We were in the net. My goodness. Bauer to serve. I'll be hogging to serve. I'll be going 17 13. Herb. It's out. 18 13. The white face is by five in the third set. Tatum is served. And uh, the white face is need seven points to win the match. Tatum serves. Canyon bumps it over. Tatum with the dig. Michael with the set. Bonnie with the swing and the kill. Body seven of the match at 1913. Again, she found the line. She has found the line. Here is Tatum to serve at 1913. Saturday at noontime up at Kellogg's. That's TV. That's our fourth service here. It's 1914. Canyon serve. Back to serve now for the Lady Eagles is Snelson. White base is trying to go 6 and 0 in the district. 38 and 2 on the year. That's out. 20 to 14. Canyon now with seven service errors. Herbert with four. Bonnie serving. We're five points away. With the Blairs and Watley up on the net. Bonnie and Miranda and Micah to back court. Your side blocked by the White Faces. That's Watley and Blair. 
forever. Uh, and the White Faces lead at 21 14, and we'll keep it here. Turbot needs four more points, Coach. Yeah, I mean, it, it, we're doing what we want to do when it comes to winning, yeah. but we really, we just had some kind of yeah. careless errors, some sort of nonchalant errors, and, you know, that's not where we want to, that's not what we need to do. We're no. going to continue to grow, and uh, our blocking, I, I know they have been working so hard on that, but. Right now, that, that is not a, a strength of ours at this moment. Well, we're ahead 21-14. I know it's we not are, right. that we're, we not, are. we're winning. We're we going are. to win here tonight. But, uh, you know, we've got high aspirations. And, mm-hmm. and you know, uh, yeah. Well, I was, I'm just thinking, I mean, we need to face some adversity. Yep. You know, we need to face some hard things. Right now, Carly's giving a little adversity. Yep. I mean, she's gnawing on them a little bit. And we need to face some of that because... We're going to see that down the road somewhere, and we must be prepared for it. Might even see it Saturday. We very well might. You're right. Carbon flood, Ernest over there. I haven't seen them. I'll be doing it. Herbert serves at 21-14. Canyon, great play by Miranda to get it up. Back off the net. Now Blair rolls to the middle, and Canyon can't play it. Nice. Nice job, Cameron Blair. 22 to 14. Good off speed. They were dug in deep. Bonnie serving now. Herbert needs three for the match. Deep middle. Canyon. Far side. End of the net. 23 to 14. Herbert needs two. Bonnie ready again. 23 14. Herbert. Again, deep middle. It's an ace. Nope. They get it across. What a save by Canyon. Herbert's a chance to score here. Bonnie out of the middle. Canyon will free ball it over. Herbert a chance now to score here. Bonnie. To Micah, over to Cameron, and they get to it. Canyon does, but they can't get it across. 24 to 14. Eight kills for Cameron Blair. A point for the match now for the White Faces. Howard Shook. Howard Shook. Here we go. Serving his body. Two deep. 24 15. Philip Shook and Howard. Birdwell over there on the far side. They've seen a few volleyball matches over the years. Serve it up 24-15 as Canyon serves here in the third set. Bonnie, Micah, Watley, and it's out. 24-16. Canyon lives to play another point. We won by scores of 13 and 17. This one's at 16 as Canyon serves. Randa, Micah, Watley hits to the floor, and that's it. Watley is seventh skill of the night. The White Faces win it 13, 17, and 16 to go to 39 and 2. I believe you are on the season, Coach. 49 and 2. That is, that's, <laughs> that's a lot. Incredible. Isn't it? That's a lot. I, I'm telling you, compared to last year, the fact that we played 41 matches yeah. is great. <laughs> it really, really is. To win 39 of them is incredible. It is. That's a lot. Well, the White Face is uh, 6-0 now in the district. We'll take a break for 60 seconds and be back and talk with the head lady in one minute. Computer running slow? Your PC may be contaminated with a virus that has dragged down its performance and could even damage important work. Pip up your computer's performance by having the technicians at WT Services check it over. WT Services offers repair, maintenance, and virus zapping services. Cure that chronic computer virus. Call their computer division today, 364-3331. WT Services, your local full-service communications company in Hereford. The tradition Charles Bryant started more than a century ago is about more than heating and cooling. It's about earning the trust of our customers across the country by taking care of their indoor comfort needs. We're continually building upon our solid history of proven reliability. So it's easy for you to sell, install, and service our products. Don't just trust anybody. Take comfort in Bob's, your Bryant factory authorized dealer. Bryant. Whatever it takes. Back courtside, Danielle's got it all set up. We're on camera here now. This is big time <laughs> stuff, Coach. Well, Coach, we were a little critical. I was. Brenda was, too. We didn't, we didn't play our best. Right. Oh, no, absolutely. That's... That's what I told him in, in the last huddle. You know, every, every ball matters. Every every yeah. point matters. Whether we earn it or if they make the error, like we we have to celebrate. Like every ball matters, and tonight we didn't do that. 
do you think? I mean, we've got a pretty big one Saturday. I Absolutely. mean, do you think that had us a little distracted? Here? I mean, it, it's possibly, you know, I mean, I think that we, we've had an odd week, you know, as far as we had those two uh, two days off, you know, and things uh, like that. And I think that, you know, it's hard to keep them focused whenever they're not, they don't have their, uh, you know, traditional schedule and, and things like that. So, you know, just. I'm glad that we're done with sure. those days off and, and we can refocus. Well, and we talk, I mean, I, again, I, I don't want to, I want to apologize, I guess, to the players <laughs> as much as anything. I mean, I watched Baltimore last night, a team that's really good, mm-hmm. struggle all night long before finally winning. And, I mean, we won by scoring 13, 17, 16, but we, we just didn't play our best. Right. What do we do there after this, get ready for Dumas? And um, what, what do you do tomorrow? You know, we, we're really going to focus on blocking, um, uh, really placing our serves tonight. We didn't do a great job of that. Um, and really just our block. I mean, getting we, we talk about our front row. You know, our front row is so big. Um, and just keep getting them, you know, involved in, in having all of our options and just kind of, you know, perfecting those. And a lot, I mean, like I said, our block is going to be sure. huge, you know, so. I thought uh, Canyon played better tonight yes, than they did the first time around. Absolutely. They're, I mean, they're getting better every week, it seems. So, so uh, you know, they've got a match left now uh, with Dumas that could be very large for them and for Dumas. Yes. For that yes. Of course, we've got one with Dumas. <laughs> it's very large. So, what do you, I mean, as you prepare for Dumas now, we played them here tough, tough first set, 29-27, I right. believe. But what do you do to get us ready to go up there? You know, I mean, just, just tough practices. You know, tomorrow won't be easy for them. Thursday certainly won't be. You know, and then and kind of tone it back on Friday maybe and, and just get them, you know, just the mentality of it. We'll probably watch a little bit of film, just kind of see, you know, things that scored on us, things that scored on them. Um, and really just, you know, we know that they have a huge block. Yep. Um, so working on coverage and, and, you know, getting us off the net some, you know, just things that can throw that block off. And Yeah, they blocked us well here the first, just that first set. <laughs> they really did, yes. They did. Well, Carly, uh, I mean, I think 39th win here tonight, 39 and 2. That's a lot of yeah. wins, Coach. Uh, uh, I know that's not what we're shooting for, but still, that's impressive. Right. Congratulations Thank to you, Coach. We'll Thank look you. forward to Saturday. All, <laughs> All right. right. I'll see you there. All right. Carly McCracken visiting with us. We'll talk with a couple of the players right now. The first of those being Tatum Stowe, the senior who had uh, a pretty good night here, I'd say, tonight. By my count, about uh, 16 kills and eight blocks and a couple of aces. Tatum, good night. Thank you. We struggled, Tatum. We talked about this. I don't want to just belabor this one, but tonight wasn't what their best. Yes. Is it hard? I, it's got to be hard. I mean, time and again, to get up and be ready and emotionally ready to play. Yes, it, it is, but we just got to do it. We can yeah, get better at I doing mean, it. I understand. <laughs> yes. I mean, and you still won, I mean, comfortably, I'd say, here tonight. Yes. Now we go to do was talk a little bit. I mean, we had a really hard time with them the first time here in her. Yes. Um, well, we've been working. Their block was really big last time we played them. So we've been working more on hitting shots instead of just swinging as hard as we can. So how do you feel we, we're we coming along as far as the team itself is concerned? And, and, again, we're trying to get ready for a deep playoff run. Yes, we're, we're just getting ready. We're getting better every day, just working hard every day. Pressure. Do you feel pressure? Yes, we do feel pressure, but that's a good thing yeah. for us. Because sooner or later, I mean, there's going to be pressure, yes. uh, whether it be next Saturday in Dumas or somewhere down the road. Yes. Well, Tatum, it was a great night. You've got two more home matches. I was just thinking, yes. hey, does that seem possible? That's crazy. Is that you know? crazy, isn't it? <laughs> well, congratulations, Thank Tatum, on, on a big night here tonight. Thank Tatum so. Bonnie Vallejo. Bonnie, uh, one of the seniors on this team, and Bonnie with seven kills here tonight. Kind of took him down the line there late, didn't you, Bonnie? Yes, I mean, I was noticing that the line was open, so I just was attacking that. As we play here tonight, now tell me a little bit, Bonnie, about where you think we are and what's going on and what, what, what Saturday will bring. I mean, I think it's, we definitely have work. I mean, we cannot see it, and it's yeah. there. It's just, I think we're struggling a little bit, but we're getting there. Saturday against Dumas. Now, you played them here. I mean, it was a battle royal. I would mm-hmm. expect more of the same on Saturday. What do you think? Yeah, it's, I mean, it's going to be hard to play there, definitely, but um, hopefully we just go out and play. Do you think of it? I mean, do you approach it any differently? Do you feel any differently as far as when you take the floor there? No, I don't think we should. I think it should be the same thing anywhere we play. So. What about the Vallejo cheering section? Will they all be there Saturday? <laughs> yeah, they will. <laughs> there every time, aren't they? Yes. Well, good night here tonight, Bonnie. A kill and uh, like a seven kills, I'm sorry, and an ace for you. And congratulations to the lady, you and the Lady Whitefaces on the 39th win of the year. Thank you. All right, Bonnie Bejo, our final 
Mister here tonight, and that's uh, going to do it for us here this evening. Again, the White Pieces win by scores of 13, 17, and 16. Go to 39 and 2, 6 and 0 in the district. Dumas on Saturday. We'll be there to broadcast that, and I'm guessing Danielle will be there, of course, to uh, help us with that broadcast on Saturday, along with her dad and mom, and perhaps even her brother. But the White Pieces victorious here tonight. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you. Uh, Saturday about noontime from Dumas with more Whiteface Volleyball. You've been listening to Lady Whiteface Volleyball on KPAN, brought to you tonight by Herford, Texas Federal Credit Union, Mendez and Mullins Family Funeral Home, Prairie Insurance, Happy State Bank, WT Services, Bob's Heating and Air, First National Bank, Def Smith Electric Cooperative, Stevens Five Star, Herford ISD, First Financial Bank, McDonald's, 